What's up guys, Matt here. I'm out here at this river lot, back at it again, and I got my buddy Dylan out here on his Yanmar excavator, and we're about to dig a hole and set the septic tank today. We got some rain coming in tomorrow, so we're gonna get the infiltrator septic lines out here. We're not gonna be able to set them today, but they'll be here on site, and we'll probably set them Monday of next week when the rain clears out so we don't have to deal with the mud. So let's go down here and watch him start this hole. Going camping and stuff like that. In fact, we built our first motor home. We bought a grill. All right, guys, we got this hole right here about five foot deep so far. The tank is actually around, what size? Five foot one tall by, by 10 foot long. So we'll have to over dig this hole just a little bit so the truck can set it down in here. And the deep part right here, he's got about five foot. He's gonna take this down and uh, we'll get it to where this is a downhill slope here. So. We'll get it to where this side of the tank's about, you know, eight to ten inches under the ground and the top will obviously be lower. So right here is going to be the lines where the back of the house is and we're going to have a concrete pad going out here maybe with a fire pit. So the tank's going to go here and then our infiltrator lines will come out of here and go straight across the lot on this knob and will actually be on this downhill grade. We've got somewhere around 300 foot of septic lines. We won't be putting those in today, but I will show you that process on the part two video. Today, we're just gonna set this tank. All right, guys, we got this uh, ditch dug here, got it all leveled out. Dylan shot the grade on it, got it completely ready. I hear the truck coming up the street. Bradley Tank and Pipe is here with this thousand gallon septic system. Let's go down here and watch them. Here we go guys there it is that tank right there weighs about 10,000 pounds and this truck right here is going to use this lift and it's going to put it in that hole and we're going to catch every bit of it right here on this video All right, guys, simple as this. This truck right here, he's got his stabilizers down and this thing is gonna set this right in here.
I, I, I use that thing, Dale. All right, guys, you just seen the difference in how a carpenter uses a level and how a idiot uses a level. All right, we got the septic tank set in here. Dylan's gonna put a little bit of dirt around it, not completely cover it up. And that's gonna conclude part one video of putting this septic in. It's supposed to rain the rest of the week and we'll be back out here Monday to put the uh, field lines in. Join us again on that video. And uh, if you like what you've seen, go down there, click the like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on the post notifications so you don't miss any more videos. And I will see y'all in the next video.